Once again, that we entered into this budget agreement despite our misgivings about the enforcement. The old problem of making a deal sleep. And you remember that we commenced those budget talks on October 27th, eight weeks ago. We met here with the leaders of the other side four weeks ago and pledged to one another that we would work to adopt the package, and now Christmas is a week away and we still don't have a deal. As you know, there must also be a provision in the continuing resolution for continuing non-lethal aid to the Nicaraguan Democratic resistance as the Senate has done before I will sign that continuing resolution. So, uh, how do you add anything before we move on? 
No, Mr. President, except to say that the people around this day have worked extraordinarily hard, long hours and under difficult circumstances, but we still aren't there yet. And, and the name of the game is to make sure that these two bills and lead to support with the agreement that was reached. Oh, yes. And I, I think there's a question uh, in some minds about Jim. whether the President will veto this thing, and as you just heard, he will veto the thing that was report. And I think, I think that's the moral high ground, the political high ground. The only bug in the milk is Christmas. But I think we just got to be prepared to face them and do whatever we need to do in order to get this thing back in shape so that it's more strong. Well, now, that's not the spirit of the ranch. Well, I've been talking with my uh, leaders there, and we got sort of mixed reviews. I mean, you got a problem with Medicaid, you got a problem with agriculture. Because there were 30 days to consume there, and everybody knew what was in the agreement. I understand there's some. Say, well, we didn't talk about $800 million in savings in Medicaid. That's Henry Waxman. But uh, I think uh, Mark indicated uh, maybe completing nearly everything went right tomorrow evening. Bring it up. Thank you. Maybe you ought to get my report. If you got well, uh, you want me to? Yeah. Uh, Mr. President, first of all, let me 